What I'm hoping for, for the seniors who are walking across the stage, um, that they take away from Faith Bridge Kids Ministry, the things that they have learned, is that they are just unconditionally loved by Jesus Christ, and hopefully His family, and that we've done everything that we could do with our love, examples, and prayers just to point them back to Jesus. My name is Connie Beaver, and I have been leading my girls in Curious for seven years. For me to get the chance to be there and just slight, you know, do what I can and maybe slightly steer them in the right direction or help them find answers or even just be someone to listen to them is something that I know is important and I do hope that I'm making stronger disciples who will then, as they get older, go on and make stronger disciples. When I had my daughter, I had several people ask, oh, so you're going to quit that Curious thing now right because you got a baby at home it's like no I can't I can't leave my girls they are they're my girls I say that and people get confused because I think I'm talking about my actual children I remember walking into the center court center court west and they said Georgia Slagle is with Connie and they split us up like I just remember thinking wow she's young and she's cool this is gonna be so fun I struggled a lot with not having like a ton of friends growing up having these girls every Wednesday night being willing to like listen to me and like talked me through things, I guess really reassuring and it made me more of a confident person and someone who's willing to like talk about stuff like this. When you hit the point of girls or guys being able to be real and authentic with each other, that makes the world of difference because all of a sudden they're going from just surface things that they would share with anyone to sharing things that are true of real community. The whole hard part of parenting is that they're letting go of your hand as they start to walk independently, and then you send them off to kindergarten, and then you send them to junior high, and on a mission trip, and into high school, and then off into the world. Parenting is just a whole series of getting your kids ready to walk away from you. The last Curious we had was a party. It wasn't like, oh, we need to hold on so tight because we're going to lose each other. It was like. No, we got tools and, you know, like practical things for Christian womanhood and Christian life. And now we're going to go and we're going to take that. We're never going to forget where we got them or how we got them. I'm hoping and praying that as they go off to wherever, whatever is next for them, that they will just continue to, f to go to Christ and to find community and find a home for their faith. And so what we're doing here at Faith Bridge at every level, no matter where your child is, is pointing them to Christ and helping them to see that He's right there with them, that He's preparing them, that He's getting them ready, that He's got them. He has them and He's got their future. And that's just the beautiful thing about what we get to see. You get to see them come year after year after year. You get to see the good things that God has done.